So Shirni's pretty excited today. Last time we didn't get the, the training session in because we did, didn't have a cameraman with me. It was a really good session. So I'm excited to see today. As anxious as she is, I think she'll do just as good as she did last time. So uh, excited to show you guys her progress. Let's get started. All right, run around. Ready? All right, now shorter on the leash and then just grab her on the chin. <laughs> she spit it out. Yeah. What do you yeah, want? Wherever. She, she literally dropped yeah, it. She, she saw you, she's like, screw this thing. <laughs> I don't want that dumb boy. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna give her a bite. Siren. Yeah. Siren. Pull, 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 pull. Oh, pull? Yeah. Sorry. Siren. Oh. Okay, loose on the leash. Loose, she said. Yep. So if I say leather in, just give her a quick second to do give a rebite and then and the then moment. Pull again? Yeah, pull again. Okay. Exactly. So let her in just means a yeah, second. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Alright. Other and if she loses you just pull her away from it. Same principle. Now drag a little bit. Yeah, good. Voila, perfect. Come, others, come forward. Yeah, from time to time, if she pulls, let her go forward. Do you think that makes sense to pull? Yeah, that makes sense. Because otherwise, she knows yeah. it's useless. All right, stop here. Yeah. Forward. Stop there. Veteran? Yeah, good. Good girl. Yeah. All right, let's do exactly the same thing. All right. <laughs> All right, go over there again, same thing. Stay there. Shh. 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 
Voila! Good girl. Good girl. Good dog. All right, outer again. Come with me. Another in. Another in. Don't pull, don't pull, don't pull. Make sure you don't pull, because now there is still tension on the leash, uh -huh. but no tension at all. We'll do one more and then she, she will have enough. Okay, what I want now is the moment she wants to pull, just let her pull all the way towards me until she has a bite. Let her pull. Yeah. Oh, good! Hey, come on! Good. Good dog. All right, that's gonna be it. Next time we don't need the pillow anymore. Yeah. We'll go straight to the sleeve. So what, what we teach them in the beginning is um, just pulling on the harness. So if I pull on my harness, the dog should only go forward. He shouldn't think about me, he shouldn't think about any obedience. For sure in the beginning, it's only going, going, going. Teach them to pull. So that's why in the beginning, it's that important to teach the dog to pull on the harness. Because you see, she is, because she is a hunting dog, she is not really pulling. You see, every time that I go closer, she is not pulling and she is just waiting until she says, okay, this is the range where I can get him. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna try before that because it then doesn't make sense. Mm -hmm. And like she for sure is just gonna pull. After two seconds, she's gonna be like, yo, I don't get any further. So I'm just gonna, you know, make it, uh, take a step back and sit and wait. We want the other way around where the dog always try to find the end of the leash, always. <laughs> so if I'm pulling, my dog should always be on the end of the leak, uh, leash, you know, like digging to go forward. So whenever the dog, I make the dog only bite with two teeth. Let us say, I'll tell you, like you see in the videos, you post up, I'll come closer and I make sure she has a bite, but not a complete full bite. So then she only bites like this and then we're gonna hold on for this like three, four seconds. And then when, because you're pulling on the harness, mm -hmm. whatever I tell you, okay, let go. Then she would go for, she should go forward and have a full grip. And then uh, for the decoys, it's easier. You will see this certain line, and the dog is never gonna go over it. Where you, as a handler, let him pull to that certain line, and then I know, okay, I can play around here. If I'm stepping in that line, I'm too close. She will have, she will have me. You know, mm -hmm. she will bite me. So in the beginning, I'm working more in defense where I'm going too close. And for sure, because uh, you see the same thing with the pillow, she's actually less excited than with the sleeve on me where it's getting a little bit more personal, mm -hmm. you know? So I have to work with her a little bit more in defense where I'm going in her certain space. She reacts on me going too close and I run away. I, I pretend I'm actually scared from her. She activates me. If she does this, I run away. She says, huh? It makes, you know, if I do this every time he runs away and then whenever I, and that's how I build that frustration a little bit, what makes her bite, you know? 
So whenever she has that, then we can work more towards the prey, towards chasing stuff, where I'm just gonna run away and she has to, you know, start pulling in the harness. So that's the thing, like, um, she is pretty internal about those things, like, who knows what's going on in her head, you know? Uh, and it's not that type of dog who is gonna show herself as being the, the show animal, like, whoa, look at me digging and barking and, you know, spit flying around, but, she is not afraid for confrontations. Like I said, with a lot of dogs, you're gonna have to work with that sleeve, with that pillow on a long leash. Why? Because if I'm gonna have the, the sleeve, me or David, whoever is gonna teach your dog, uh, that new person is a new person for them. It's like, ooh, I might not trust that guy. So a lot of dogs, for sure on that age, because they never did bite work, even if they are bred for it. If I'm gonna grab a pillow and I'm gonna make it cra the dog crazy for the pillow, she might bite the pillow, but she might not bite it really close to me because then she's gonna say yeah but that confrontation is way too much i can tell she likes the confrontation yeah. that's for her seems to be more appealing than yeah i like you said prey or last time when you didn't have a cameraman you saw the difference yourself oh, yeah. two such two take two times with a pillow and then i took the sleeve the whip and the dog was like oh that's something else that's what i want yeah 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 <laughs> and you see the dog changing and that's what i mean like she in that way she is into it she is not afraid from people you know